The Niagara Parks Commission officially opened the redeveloped Falls Incline Railway this week. Seven million dollars of provincial government funding helped make the railway wheelchair accessible. It's also now a year-round service. It is fabulous today to be on the first ride of the new incline. The incline can accommodate 40 people at a time. Today we had uh, 37 people there. We had uh, children. We had people who required accessible service. It was just exciting to be there with people and to come over there and see right over the crest of the falls. It's a view beyond belief from that incline. Each rail car can accommodate two wheelchairs or scooters as well as 37 passengers. Back in May this year, the Niagara Parks was very honoured to receive a Breaking the Barrier Award from the March of Dimes and we're very grateful to Linda Crabtree who nominated us for that award and that was for the initiative that we're taking in improving accessibility within Niagara Parks but specifically for the Incline Project. The trip takes a little over one minute and at peak service will transport more than a thousand people per hour. In 2012, we had almost 600,000 riders on the Incline Railway, but that was not a full year-round operation. It wasn't able to run after the end of October. So we're now looking forward to a full 12-month operation, and that will be another beautiful view in the wintertime to come down and see Niagara Falls from up above. Visit NiagaraParks.com for more information. In Niagara Falls, William Kelly, The Source.